So you guys are probably using Discord like everybody does. Uh, it's one of the biggest chat programs. <laughs> so with it being the biggest, obviously client mods have come out. You have better Discord, you have Vencord. Uh, both of them allow plugins, themes, custom CSS, so on and so forth. Um, I'll leave a link to the better Discord and Vencord. I'll leave a link to the Discord servers as well below. Um, I'm just making this video for you guys who don't know about it. Uh, they're pretty sick on what you can do. I like Vencord a little more because it comes preloaded with some plugins. I believe better Discord don't, but they obviously have a website where you can browse plugins. I would imagine some of them are going to be broke, some of them aren't. That's the thing I like about Vencord. So when you install Vencord, you're going to click on your settings. It's obviously going to be at the bottom. I have, a, I have a thing that moved it up here. And you obviously have your Vencord settings. You have plugins, themes, so you can you can make a theme or you can grab a better Discord theme that was made or something and put the link in here. I have a all black Discord, as you can see. You also have updater, so you can update and check for updates, which is pretty cool. Desktop settings, and then you have backup and restore, so you can kind of save these and uh, load them up again. Your settings, so if you're moving from client to client to client and you don't want to fuck around, here you go. But as I said, there's a pile of plugins, always animate, so everything that is a GIF will move. Um, and it's not based on you having your cursor over it. Better uploads, clear URLs, there's fake Nitro, experiments, emo clone, favorite GIFs, force crown, image zoom, pin, message logger, message, message tags, um, mute newly joined guilds. Like, as you can see, there is a pile of stuff here. Pin DMs, platform indicators, preview message, quick mention, quick reply, so on and so forth. Reveal all spoilers, show all message buttons. So if you're highlighting over your message button, you can literally see like all the delete, edit, whatever it may be. Um, and again, there's a pile of plugins. And the thing I like about Vancord is normally the devs are pretty quick on updating these when they do break. Where better Discord, again, it's going to be a hit and miss. Uh, I prefer Vancord a lot more because of the team and the people behind this. They updated a lot more. Um, as you can see, my, my sidebar here for a channel list looks a little different. I can go to different servers, and again, you can see that announcement channels are red, forms are pink, text channels with threads go yellow, normal text channels with no threads are blue, voice channels are green, and this is all done, again, because these clients allow plugins and themes, and I obviously have a theme, they also allow custom CSS. so. If you have CSS or you were a user of this and your CSS broke, I will leave a link to where you can copy your CSS. So you would, you know, obviously highlight all this. Control C, you'd go to the website, paste it in, and then you would hit the copy button on the website, post it back into here, and it should all, for most part, update. Um, some CSS, again, is going to be a little different. But yeah. If you guys have never used Vancord or Better Discord, I would say check them both out. Again, Vancord has pre-loaded um, plugins. And again, I'm on their server right now. So you can see the CSS development. They also have a channel too where CSS code will actually get posted. Sometimes they have a screenshot. So as you can see here, somebody did something where... It adds a pile of stuff, um, and you could just scroll up and keep scrolling. There's plenty of different things. Um, you can have your message and 
jump to present on the right side, so on and so forth. Um, even better Discord has this as well. They have a custom CSS section and then they have one where people have posted stuff and you can grab the CSS. Now, before you ask, no, you cannot use better Discord stuff on Vencord. Do, do like the plugins, you can't install them. There's no way that it's not cross cross compatible. If you're going to use one, you have to use one. You don't want to try and load these all on top of each other. It will bug out and you'll end up with a mess. So you either pick one. Vencord or better Discord. Again, you could try them both out. You could install the public test beta and or the Canary version of Discord on your desktop or Mac or whatever. And you can load one with Vencord and load the other with better Discord and see which one you like. And or if you go to the um, Vencord website, I'll, I'll probably leave the GitHub and the website below. You can download their built-in client called the Vestop. And basically you can pick whether it's the standard, the public test beta canary version of Vestop and you just load it up. With the Vestop, you obviously will have Vestop settings. If you just inject into your normal Discord, you won't see this, but you have different options here. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Peace out. Pimp out your Discord. See you in my next one. I wanna be the greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow 